This week on the Trend Out Loud podcast, Erica's not allowed to call Space a, a racial slur, but a black girl would have been able to call her a racial slur? Like, I'm so confused by this. All right, so Erica Mena has been let go, fired, whatever you want to call it, from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta because she called Spice a blue monkey. Uh, here it is. By the way, shout out to Spice. Prop, 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 yard dings. So after that aired, everybody was going crazy. Oh my gosh, that's a racial slur, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And then Eleven Hip Hop put out this announcement. The Eleven Hip Hop franchise has never shielded away from hard controversy in our community. Working hand in hand with our partners, viewers will see the impact of Erica Mena's remarks play out in their in the final three episodes of the season. Effective immediately, she will not appear in the next season of Love and Hip Hop. I am so confused by this. Like, I don't get it. So, okay, look, let's let's just agree that the term monkey is like using the N-word. It's a racial slur. Yes, let, let's do that. There's some people who um, just hilarious came out and she was like, uh, maybe she looked like, maybe Spice looked like a monkey to her and she's calling her a monkey. Totally don't agree with that. She said it in in a racial way, right? Um, but my whole thing is that I went to go and to see what Erica Mena's um, background is. And a simple uh, Google search will tell you that Erica Jasmine Mena is an American actress, uh, model, television personality, video vixen, uh, she's been on Love and Hip Hop franchises from 2011 to 2023, uh, New York and Atlanta. And then you go, let me look at her personal life. Erica Mena is of Puerto Rican and Dominican ancestry. Puerto Rican, Dominican ancestry. Black and brown. For years, we have been grouping black and brown people together. From George Floyd to Trevor Martin to whatever, every fight has been about black and brown. And then when you dig a little deeper, um, you go to the people, the historical people, and they say that Puerto Rico, Dominican, Spanish, whatever, they're all, we're all black people. We just were dropped off on, at different countries along the way during slavery. But if you go back in time, that we're all like Puerto Ricans, Dominicans, whatever. We're all black people. If you even want to go back, well, sorry, that, not as far back as that, but in entertainment, when J Lo used the, the N word on the Ja Rule song, it was like, yo, could, could J Lo use the N word? And it was like, of course she can. You reunited with uh, J Lo. I remember when, was it I'm Real? Yeah. Came out and she used the N word. Was there like a sit down like, I'm not sure if I should say this line or not? Not at all. It's kind of a unwritten thing that Spanish and Puerto Ricans and niggas and we're all kind of yeah. in the same family and, and she, you know, so it's like, why can't she say nigga? That <laughs> Joe says it. Oh, I, all my Spanish niggas I know say nigga. So if monkey is equivalent to the N-word, and it's a racial slur, but it's coming from a black person, it's okay. But a Puerto Rican person who we say is Afro-American, like Afro African-American, and we all come from the same, our motherland, and we're in the same fight, then Erica's not allowed to call Spice a, a racial slur, but a black girl would have been able to call her a racial slur? Like, I'm so confused by this. And there's people who are trying to use 
the um the uh the uh what's the word i'm looking for uh colorism as as saying that because erica is light skin and spice is dark skin then that's why she's calling her a monkey and because that because spice is dark skin then that's the the thing where the, they have a problem with it. it's colorism and it's like Yo, that's that's a that's very bold of you to be like, well, I'm in Erica's head. I know that she's calling her that racial slur because she doesn't see her as her equal because she's darker skin and she's lighter skin. And don't get me wrong, colorism is is very very real. Trust me, I've been to Africa twice, apartheid. I've been to Nelson Mandela's cell. I I, I know everything about colorism in Africa and in Jamaica. I I know about it. All I'm just saying is, is that. How could them getting into an argument bring you to think that's, that that Erica is 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 using the colorism card? I just it's just too much. Like I just don't agree with it. Um, and listen, I'm not saying that what Spice all what Spice did was right because that's a lot of people are in the comments being like, "Yo, Spice shouldn't have opened her mouth about her son. She went after." Her son, and you go after someone's son, doesn't, it's all off limits, right? That's, you know, that's what Jess Hilarious is saying, right? Yo, you talk about my son, I'm coming after you. And fine, but us as the public and love and hip hop, you can't go to somebody who's Dominican and Puerto Rican and say you want them off of the show because they use a racial slur when they're part of the community and when we're together. Why are we separating now the Puerto Rican and Dominicans? Now, for using racial slurs against black people, like that's what the thing that I don't agree with. And if black people can call other black people the N-words or call them monkeys and that's okay, then Erica should be able to do it. Now, outside of black and brown people, Asians, white people, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, uh, you know, um, Arabs, whatever, like that's a whole different story. If we're going to keep that a buck. No, don't, don't call me a monkey and don't call me an N-word. We're going to put it together. But I don't feel like there's anything wrong with Erica saying that and i don't think that it's fair to assume because spice is dark skin and erica is light skin that she called her that and 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 used the colorism card because that's not fair and and you don't know that um anyway so so that's my take on it um regardless yo spice is jamaican i'm, I'm on spice the side yo anything that happens yo i'm down for the oddies but um no, all jokes aside, it's um a first of all, it's content, it's TV, love and hip hop. This is what they do. So I'm not surprised by this because this they have been known to do this kind of stuff all the time. I wouldn't be surprised if this was probably written in the script because this is just what reality TV does. But I'll admit that this one does seem a little bit um organic and and I don't like seeing um, black and brown people um, separated and 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 talking about racial slurs. We have enough racism and discrimination um, out here um, against other races. Um, let's keep our Puerto Ricans, our Dominicans, our Spanish people, our our, our brown brothers and sisters um, um, together, um, and let's not try to separate that when when we feel um, like we want to. But then when white people do it then we're going to group us all together i don't think that's fair so shout out to erica and shout out to spice um shout out to the whole uh love and hip-hop franchise y'all doing your thing man you owned you owned the um the social media airways uh for a long time and you know it was a good couple of days people were talking about this and i'm sure um we won't hear the uh this is not the end of it safari just weighed in and said something or whatever i think we're going to be talking about this um for a little while but anyways um, let's stick together, y'all. Who gives a f what Ja Rule thinks at a time like this? This is ridiculous. I want some answers that Ja Rule might not have right now. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy, Turn Out Loud. Peace!